This is Andy Pulloff, Boxing Social in association with Betfred, joined by trainer Shane McGuigan, fresh off the pro debut and the first victory under the slate of Caroline Dubois. Shane, congratulations to you, to the team. How would you assess Caroline's performance? I thought, you know, seeing as her debut, I think she did fantastically well. She's in there with a real seasoned pro. Um, someone that's just gone six rounds of Natasha Jonas, went six rounds of um, Ebony Jones as well. She's been in there, mixed it with a lot of people. So, um, you know, she didn't, she didn't lose a round, didn't get hit at all really. She got hit with one shot in the last round. Uh, but everything was a little bit forced. Everything was a bit, you know, it was trying a bit too hard. It's different. It's a different occasion. She's going in there without a head guard on, without a vest on, with two ounce less gloves and with eight ounce gloves. So these are all things that are, are different variables. Um, so it's all things to, 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 to have to adapt to. But, um, you know, and also most importantly, she's going in there with an opponent that's surviving, not trying to win and not trying to take it to you. So it's, uh, it's, it takes time to learn how to break these girls down, how to work behind the jab, how to, you know, how to settle down. But, um, that's part of the journey. You know, she's just turned 21 years of age. Unbelievable talent. Um, but just, it doesn't matter who she was in there against tonight. It was always a, it was a battle with herself, learning to deal with your nerves, deal with the occasion. Not many people get this, this, this occasion to be put in, you know, two fights in the main event. You know what I mean? So it's a massive occasion. Everyone's singing "Sweet Caroline." A lot to overcome. Uh, but she did once. Once that first second round was done, she settled into the fight and she, she looked a lot better. Did you ever feel like watching the fight that if, if she'd have maybe been a bit more aggressive, the opportunity was there to stop uh, her opponent? Definitely, she was, yeah. But once again, she was, well, she was a bit wide of the punches and trying a bit hard. You know, I think if she'd have walked in a little bit more, definitely she would have found it. But um, it's, it's all new. You know, it's, it's all new. It's boxing without a head guard. She said, this is different. I'm boxing without a head guard. So it's something different. You know what I mean? It's, it's, a, it's a new experience. And, and even though we know that that person's not, you know, not punching very hard and, and, and hesitant to throw. When you're in there, you, you've, she's having respect for her opponent because she knows that you know, there's less protection. So it's, just, it's, it's all experience, but once, give her one or two more fights and she, you know what I mean? she'll be able to start showing that talent. But it's, uh, from what I'm seeing in the gym, it's, it's, she's special, special talent, genuinely special. But she's boxing girls that are all coming there to give her work and try, try and put it on her. And that girl there tonight, tonight was just purely in survival mode. So it's just, it's, it's hard to look, it's hard to look good, especially her being a counter puncher against someone that's so defensive. Final one, Shane, what is going to be next for her? What would you like to see her do next in terms of the rest of this year? Oh, she's going to be out in the end of March. Uh, she's going to take a week off, straight back in the gym, and we'll, uh, we'll get another opponent, we'll go again in the end of March. I think she'll probably be on the same bill as Adam and Hassan at the end of March. Um, that's what we're aiming for. And good thing she picked up no injuries, got six rounds, blew, blew off the cobwebs, hadn't boxed since the Olympics. So, uh, you know, all, the, all of these things are all, all the boxes ticked. I'll right, leave it there and I'll leave you to enjoy the rest of your evening. Thank you for speaking to me in Boxing Social. Cheers, Annie. Appreciate it. <laughs>